Hi, Assalamualaikum warahmatullahi wabarakatuh. My name is Rashidah binti Ramali and here is a video about my insect collection for entomology course. So, this is the places where I collect my insects, which are around my house, Ulu Kangsa, Taman Herba UKM, Tasik UKM, Paddy Field, and Batu Hampa. For method of collecting, I use both active sampling and passive sampling. For active sampling, I use aerial net to catch wing insects such as butterfly, dragonfly, and damselfly. And for uh, insects that are not flying, I just simply pick up them with my hands. Whereas for active sampling, I use a light trap and as well as yellow pen trap. But for yellow pen trap, I was hardly get any insects because it was a rainy season at that time. For light trap, I just simply use a white shades and UV light. This is the UV light and this is how I'm setting my light trap. I'm setting the light trap at 6.30pm and wait about 1-2 to two hours later. Make sure to avoid or limit any other source of light when setting the light trap. It is a very good method to collect nocturnal species like moths. And most of my collected moths and beetle were from the light trap. Next, for killing and preservation method, most of the insects were killed by ethyl acetate. A tissue containing ethyl acetate was put into the killing jar. But for Lepidoptera and Odonata, they were killed by pressing their thorax. Lepidoptera and Odonata were then preserved in the freezer before pinning onto the setting board. Whereas other insects like Coleoptera and Orthoptera were preserved in the alcohol with at least 70%. Another insect tools are alcohol to preserve the insects, insect collection box, killing jar to kill the insects with ethyl acetate, number 2 and number 3 entomology pin, and a pinning block which is used to place an insect and label at a proper height, and then setting board to spread the insect's wing. Pinning and drying. A hardened insect can be relaxed by placing in a container with damp hot tissue, especially for Lepidoptera and Odonata that have been preserved in a freezer before. Wings of Lepidoptera and Odonata were spread at the setting board. Then, they were sent to the lab for drying at least 3 days. But basically, it depends on their size. A bigger insect will need a longer time to dry. So here is the collected species of Lepidoptera. Diptera Odonata Coleoptera Hemiptera Orthoptera Hymenoptera Dermoptera Blatodia And last but not least, Trichoptera Here, I found a butterfly showing a beautiful hair pencil from the tip of the abdomen. This hair pencil is pheromone signaling structure present in male Lepidopteran. Male will use this structure in courtship behavior with females. Insects are diverse creature. Entomology acknowledges us about biodiversity, agriculture, evolution, and human disease. Their size, color, shape, biology, and life history are so numerous that it makes study of insects actually fascinating. Without insects, most plants on Earth would disappear and we would lose most reptiles and amphibians. Despite all their positive attributes, some insects sure can cause problems. Unfortunately, most people are more aware of a few insects that can cause problems rather than many beneficial insects. Uninformed people think that all insects are bad and all need control. So that's all from me. Thank you.